Hello, Lady Quinn here. <clears throat> In this video, I'm just going to show you some quick ways of cutting. Um, many times we struggle to cut. Not only do we struggle to cut straight, but also to uh, measure what we are supposed to be cutting. So this is a muslin right here. Um, I'm going to show you a quick way of measuring. Let's say, let me see, this thing has, it's an eight inches, right? Now, what happens is if I said, okay, let's cut an eight by eight inches, you probably will measure this side and then measure eight over here and then mark another eight over there mark that join lines and cut and so on all of that is correct but it's time consuming so let's say you want to cut an eight by eight and i know it for a fact that this is eight inches long and that means this side is eight inches. let me show you this side is actually called the selvage the part of the fabric that is sealed the selvage is let me show you this the sealed edge of the fabric when you pull thread try to pull thread there nothing comes uh, the other edges though you can see the frayed edges okay they have no selvage now one property of this selvage is that it is always straight it is very straight because it's sealed so many times when you don't know people tend to cut off this Salvage, but it helps us a whole lot in measurement. So we realize this is eight inches. Let's say I want you to cut an eight by eight square. All you have to do is grab that eight inches, position it on the other end. So this eight inches naturally or automatically measured eight inches here. And then when you cut over here, you're going to get your eight by eight square. So assuming you're trying to make a bag or uh, any measure, measurement of a blouse or uh, squares, let's just say the squares, instead of measuring every piece and drawing lines and struggling, just measure the straight part, which is the selvage. And whatever measurement you need, let's say 15 inches, 20 inches, once you get that, grab it and put it on the other end the diagonal because you need a square when you put it on the diagonal like this it transfers that same eight inches to this place so once you cut here you are <clears throat> actually getting your exact size with no markings or anything now let's say you want to create a bag that has a fold at the bottom here but you want to measure it into a square or you want to create a square out of that i'm going to actually cut a square out of this right now um you can use the same process you don't have to fold and then measure is it eight inches no just do the same thing when i put this here because this was eight inches it transfers that measurement to this place all i have to do is take a take note of that point over there okay that's my point my mark and then i grab this and fold it over once you fold it over it brings the exact measurement that you need in a double okay so sorry you go ahead and you cut right here next to the the salvage that way you didn't even have to do too much measuring you have been able to create a perfect square and it, this is a double to create your bag or whatever else you intend to use it for. Thank you.